a very sharp point at the top of the spire. New branch plaza from the early 90s. Postmodern Art Deco reminds me of the Chrysler building in New York City. Or yeah. Trump Tower Chicago coming back with the view here on the left. The third college building in the room. hotel than luxury condos, the third tallest in America. At the base, these steel tubes are called caissons. They're filled with concrete. They go through the wet topsoil about 70 feet into the bedrock. They got to go through the topsoil to anchor a skyscraper on a swamp. Coming back to the Wrigley building, Focus Ah, uh, that Martin Heidegger river flow uh, phenomenology. What well, the Ang phenomenology related to existentialism. 
Then existentialism. Then. Oh, okay. Heidegger related to them. Heidegger, Herschel, then. Major phenomenology. Now, rather than clean up the river, we do it the Chicago way. It's all about gravity. We bring in the Army Corps of Engineers. Sino yung pinagsabihan na it's unproven na Nazi? Heidegger or si Husserl na Nazi? Bakit siya pinagsabihan dahil nagsurso? So some people say because he's, you know, his philosophy is tainted, but others say it's a separate thing. Yung ano niya, pagka... So, mabasa kong ano mo, thesis mo? Ha? Mababasa kong thesis mo? Designed by Kurt Mohan, grandson of the great botanist innovator Mies van der Rohe, creating a beautiful public space. So, but you're not Pili Mo. So, hi, the girl. Because the teacher is a college. Okay. So, many of you have learned about that. Okay, makes sense. Wow, theologian, sir. Wow. He's now an SBD. Uh oh. Not German, but a provincial superior. Wow. Si si makliing dulag ba SVD? Makliing dulag. Ito na yung napatay na. Igorot. Sinong sagat na SVD? Ha? Bishop na po mo sa'yo, no? It's not SVD. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Chicago Bulls Scotty Pippen, actors John and Joan Cusack, Goldie Hawn and Kurt Russell, Dolly Parton, and my favorite in his crime, Robert Alice. Oprah Winfrey never lived here. Oh, never? That's a green urban myth. She had the top three floors of the Ritz Carlton Hotel. No. Sender. Straight ahead of us now is a lock which separates the lake and the river. Now that the lake empties into the river, we have to control that outflow to maintain a consistent lake level. In fact, we're hoping we're historically low Great Lakes water level, so the lock is very important. If Captain Paul were to take us out to Lake Michigan, we'd go straight ahead through two sets of gray steel double doors where they can equalize the water level. The lock built by the mighty Army Corps of Engineers in the 1930s. Here on the left, Finally, Navy Pier, completed in 1916 as Municipal Pier Number 1, a commercial port of call for Great Lakes shipping. Later, renamed Navy Pier in honor of naval veterans of World War I, the way Soldier Field is named for Army veterans of World War I. During the Second World War, this was a naval training base where we train pilots in taking off from and landing onto boats out in the lake, converting old lake and river steamers into mock aircraft carriers. Trainees included the first President Bush. The naval base was closed after the Second World War, and here became the campus of the University of Illinois at Chicago until they moved out in the 1960s. Then for a couple of decades, we didn't know what to do with it. This tourist variety center opened in 1993 so, and is now the number one <laughs> I thought you were in the state of Illinois. Oh, oh my God. 
<laughs> what happened to him? <laughs> Did you go down? Did you go down there? After our first World's Fair, the World's Columbian Exposition of 1893 took place to the right of a four miles down shore of what is now Jackson Park, where the Daniel Burnham, the lead architect, But at the World's Fair, Burnham had a rival, Louis Sullivan, also designing for that World's Fair. But Burnham and Beaux Arts was old school. Sullivan said, make it new, get your forms from nature. Both Burnham and Sullivan continue to influence how our skyline looks. Now Sullivan had a protege by the name of Frank Lloyd Wright. So Frank Lloyd Wright worked for Louis Sullivan, particularly Okay. Now I'll get one. What? Oh, your photo? Okay. Hold.